Hey everybody, it's Ryan. Welcome back. Welcome to the Investing Channel. In this video, we're going to look at another stock. Why? Because some of you guys that like to trade stocks are asking for me for two more videos on price predictions for stocks. So this one, I'm going to do SQQQ. I jumped in on the 2nd of August and I jumped in with about a thousand bucks. So I got about 24 shares, I think. And uh, I'm going to share with you guys what my entry point was and what my take profit is. Okay. So more often than not, when I, when I jump into a trade, I let you guys know I do a video and then uh, I let you know what my exit point is going to be. And what it is, it's just a waiting game for it to swing around, hit that point, okay? I just have to relax and I have to wait. And I'm going to show you why this technique is working for me, okay? If my technique's working nine out of 10 times, it's working 90% of the time, okay? Um, so uh, let's keep going. Also, uh, this Sunday, I'm having another Thin Men's Wallet giveaway. Uh, I'm going to give away this right here. For free, it's a Thin Men's Wallet. It also has a money clip on it. So if you guys are interested in winning this, if you maybe your wallet's really fat or uh, your wallet's falling apart, you got holes in it, uh, I'll give this away to somebody. I'll be drawing online or online so you guys can see the win. And uh, the only thing you have to do to enter is two things. It's free to enter. Uh, look down below the video. There's a thumbs up icon. If you could just click it with your mouse, tap it with your finger. If you're sitting at a restaurant, eat a burger, eat fries. Um, and then the other thing is, is somewhere down below in the comments, write the word SQQQ, an S and three Qs. You can say whatever you want, but just add that somewhere in there and you'll be entered in on the drawing this Sunday, okay? And if you guys are thinking about jumping into any stocks or coins, let me know down below. Maybe I'll do a video for you guys so you guys can see what I'm seeing and then you can it'll help you with your due diligence, okay? Okay, let me keep going here. All right, here we go. I'm in on TradingView. I do my stock trading on uh, TD Ameritrade, the Thinkorswim platform. But I like to show you guys with the TradingView. I like to do my analysis on TradingView. So let me show you what I did and then I'll show you why I chose that, okay? All right, so right in here, let me blow this up a little bit more. So right now, here's the price, 44.53. Today's the 30th of August, 2022. I bought $1,000 worth over on 8.222. I bought 24 shares at 40.42. So that was probably right in this range right over here, okay? I'm on the one-day chart. So what I'm doing is I'm hoping it's gonna get right up to this point, and it should. It should be able to get there, okay? And uh, we're going to calculate how much money that will be, okay? I'm going to show you guys here in a minute. So keep watching. You're going to see some stuff you haven't seen before. Don't leave yet. Okay, so let me show you why I'm choosing that exit point. So let's take a look at it. And you're going, oh my God, this thing is dropping like a rock. Look at that. Don't get nervous. Don't get scared. I'm going to show you guys can still make money in a bear market, okay? Let me show you. We're getting there. Hold on a second. Okay, so what I do is I draw bases on charts. You saw all those lines. And more often than not, what happens is once price action goes below it, it'll usually swing back up. And that lets me know that I'm buying in the dip, right? So let me show you this one right here. So back over here, it broke in February of 18. It broke down. And then what did it do? It shot back up and it touched that line. So if I would have bought in here, I could have wrote it back up. Here's another one. It broke it again, went way down here. It went from roughly $2,026 all the way down to about $1,088. So almost down a thousand bucks. And then what did it do? It shot back up. It touched that point went a little above it, but then it went back right back down, okay? So on something like this, I do not set my take profit above it. I set it right at that line. More than more than not, I set it below it because I want to make sure that I'm taken out. It's a bear market. I don't want to sit around, uh, fiddle around and wait for it to you know come back around fully. I want to get my money out. Um, here's another one. It broke that base, swung down. I could have bought down here and wrote it back up. It broke right there. It came back up. It broke right there and came back up. It broke right there and came back up. That one, that one, that one, blow it up. So it swung down here, came back up. It swung down there, came back up. And this one, so all of these I could have jumped in on. I could have waited and I could have taken profit, okay? Let's keep going. So this is kind of where we're entering into now. You know, this thing, I mean, this thing has potential on a long-term hold. Once, if we go back into a uh, bull market, this thing could potentially get up to $3,600 on a bull market. If we're having a good bull market, if something glorious comes and like changes the way things are working globally and everyone's confident in buying in, it could get there, you know? So I could buy in here a little bit and sit and wait and, you know, just to throw away money and, and hope that it comes back up there. Um, okay, so all these points, history has shown that it comes back around to at least that point. Okay, so this is where we're at. I've shown you multiple times that it's come around. So this is kind of where we're at right here. Let me show you recently. It's come right back up there. It's come right back up. On that line, 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 on that line. And here's where we're at. Now it's kind of hard to see. I'm trying to blow it up for you guys. Uh, so it's come in, it's it swung up and hit that line, it swung up and hit that line, it hit that line, it hit that line, hit that line, hit that line. So 
this is where my take profit's at. That's why I chose that point right there. I could set it up higher. I could just sit back and wait. Um, but if I want to take a quick profit, which I'm going to do on SQQ, Q, uh, I'm going to set it there. So let's go ahead and calculate that out real quick, okay? You guys can, um, well, I'll give you guys some hints here. Okay, so this is my spreadsheet. What I do is I put in the date that I bought in. I put in, these are how I get an estimate on how much money I'm going to make and what how much I want to invest. So this is just an analysis, okay? Uh, what I do is I come in here, I put in my entry point. I put in my exit point. It calculates out what my profit's going to be. And it tells me what my percentage of profit is going to be. So what I can do is I can come over here under the investment catalog uh, category and I can say, you know what I'm going to do? I have 750 bucks and I can change it. And over here, watch what happens over here by the green area. Boom, changes it right away. So what I can do is I can play with these numbers and just choose how much I want to change it to invest. Okay, so I did a thousand. So let's do a thousand. Okay, so I got roughly the 24. Uh, it says coins, but it's shares because we're dealing with stocks. Okay, so if I wait for that point for the 4981 right here, I'm making 23% of my money in you know a little over a month. That's not bad. Some of you guys are uh, happy with 2%. <laughs> um, but let's go ahead. Let's let's go further up the line. Remember how I said it's going to gradually make its way up? Um, it's just a matter of sitting and waiting. Let's try 6575. 6575. And if you guys want a copy of this uh, spreadsheet, I'll give it to you for free. I'll show you in just a second how you can get it. Uh, okay. 63% of my money, if I let it run up to 65.75, on $1,000, I'm making 626. On $500, I'm making 313. On 2,500, I'm making 1566. Now, I'm not telling you guys to put this amount in. This is just your due diligence. You guys use whatever other indicators you look at and make your own decisions, okay? But this is how I trade. Uh, it works for me. I am, you know, I do have a lot of coins that I'm I'm waiting to swing back around. It's a it's a uh, bear market, so I'm, I'm waiting for a while, like a lot of us, but I haven't sold anything yet, okay? Um, so let's try the 79.37. Look at 96% of my money. Let's go up to six. Wait, six, wait hold on a second. Oh, 91.66. I just forgot. 91.66. You guys can take a picture of this area if you want for your own records. Uh, 91.66. 91.66 would get me to 127. Okay. Now let's say, for example, just for fun, let's say this thing, let's say the bull market hits. Global economy is uh, is swinging back around. All these people that have been doing so much, you know what, to all of us. And, uh, you know, let's say it gets back up to the, those guys get arrested. Um, let's go up to 30. We'll go up to, let's just say 3,600. Let's see what happens. Uh, 3,600. I know it's a pipe dream, but let's see. Boom, 8,000, 8,800% profit. So if I put in 500 bucks and I just say, you know what? I got enough money. I'm going to let it ride, baby. Uh, I'm going to make 44000 on my money. Pretty good, huh? 8,800%. Wow. Uh, I think I'll be doing that. Um, okay. So I said I would give this spreadsheet to you guys, and I will for free. So what you can do is, uh, first of all, look over here. There's a little red icon over here. Follow me on YouTube. Uh, click the bell when it pops up and choose all so that you're notified. You guys can always ask me questions down below in the comments or say, hey, I'm thinking of, you know, Netflix or I'm thinking of Starbucks or Facebook or whatever. What do you see? Let me know and I'll do a quick video for you. Um, but also what I'll do is if you guys want this spreadsheet, head over to my Instagram channel. Here it is. Let me get over there. Home. Bam. Okay. It's investing points. Hold on. There it is. Investing points. Okay. Follow me over there on Investing Points. Send me a DM message and say, hey, Ryan, can I have your spreadsheet? Okay. And what I do is I do a lot of price predictions for other people that ask me questions, and I'll populate them in here. I also have a, uh, a TikTok account. Um, it's Investing Points also. You can follow me over there if you like TikTok. I don't dance or anything, uh, but I will do some price predictions. And I have one over on Twitter too. Uh, so if you guys want to follow me over there. Um, blah, 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 blah. So you guys can see here, I've got people asking me for the spreadsheet quite a bit. They're asking me questions and stuff, okay? So I want to thank you guys for watching. I'll do more crypto here probably for, I'll, I'll throw some up on Wednesday. I'll try to. And uh, thank you guys for watching. And I'll send this video to a friend. All right, thanks guys for watching. Bye-bye.